Oh my God! Sussex's kids down in dumps after Cambridge's kids to stunning appearance at key royal event. Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Archie Harrison are beloved by royal fans, but they rarely make public appearances alongside their respective royal parents Kate and William and Harry and Meghan. Here is why George, Charlotte, Louis, Archie and Lilibet could make a rare appearance at a key royal event this year. This year is unlike any other year for the royal family, as 2022 marks the platinum jubilee of Queen Elizabeth II. As the first British monarch to reach this incredible milestone, all the stops are being pulled out with national celebrations planned over a four-day bank holiday weekend. Several working members of the royal family are expected to make an appearance during the celebrations, but royal fans will also hope to see the adorable children of Kate, Duchess of Cambridge and Prince William, and Prince Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex. Several royal events have been planned for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee this year, but Trooping the Colour is expected to be one of the most significant. Every year, the Queen's birthday is celebrated with a special parade called Trooping the Colour in London. For the past two years, the event has been held at a much smaller scale at Windsor Castle during the coronavirus pandemic and its associated lockdown restrictions. But with restrictions all but completely eased in England, the Platinum Jubilee edition of Trooping the Colour in June is expected to be back to its former glory. Crowds of people always line the streets of London to catch a glimpse of the royal family as they wave from the Buckingham Palace balcony. In light of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee, we might expect several senior royals to appear at the celebrations this year, such as the Queen's children Prince Charles and Princess Anne, and her grandson Prince William. Members of the Queen's extended family have also appeared at previous Trooping the Colour events, including her cousins, grandchildren and great-grandchildren. During previous birthday parades, some of the royal family's youngest members have made cameos on the balcony, with Prince Louis making his debut in 2019. The Cambridge children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, have been known to watch the RAF fly past with great interest and wave to the crowds in previous years. So this year, although attendees for the event are unconfirmed presently, it is expected George, Charlotte and Louis will appear for Trooping the Colour 2022 based on past precedent. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle now live in the US, but they could also return to the UK later this year for the Platinum Jubilee. As the Sussex's eldest child Archie and youngest child Lilibet have yet to make their Trooping the Colour debuts, they may also appear on the Buckingham Palace balcony this year. Meghan and Harry welcomed Archie in May 2019, so he was perhaps too young to watch the spectacle a month later for the first time. And due to the pandemic, Archie has missed out on the previous two Trooping the Colours like the rest of the Queen's great-grandchildren. So this year may finally be the year Archie and little Lilibet get to see the royal spectacle for themselves. Life as a royal parent looks busy, to say the least, keeping up with public engagements, tours abroad, homeschooling during the lockdown and then the normal mum and dad duties at home. It's no wonder many of the royal family have employed nannies to lend a hand over the years. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge recruited their long-term nanny, Maria Theresa Turry in Borrello, from the prestigious Norland College in Bath, England, and we often spot the Spanish staff member with the high-profile family. Whether it's helping out at a big family event like a christening or to taking the kids for a walk in London's Hyde Park, Maria Borrello is always there for the royal children. Trustworthy, discreet and immaculately dressed, a royal nanny is responsible for making sure the little ones are on their best behaviour.